game your settings file changes you need to apply right now on your PC in order to get maximum FPS, lower input delay and faster response time out of your mouse and keyboard. So guys welcome to my channel, if it's your first time here please subscribe, drop a like and also make sure to share your PC specs in the comment below and I will give you some free suggestion that will help you to improving your FPS and your PC performance. So guys in the very first step here we got this best game you setting file, so open up the folder, inside you will find out here all the pre made setting for your high end PC, low end PC and mid end PC. This is the shortest way to guys applying the best settings on your PC using my this best game use settings pack. Link in the description simply go there and download these files on your PC and guys using this file you can apply all the best settings on your PC according to your PC specs by just simply replacing this file. So guys if you need this pack so you can download it from a website so let's go for the manual method. So guys in the manual method first of all you need to locate the fortnite game use settings location so fortnite plus windows are together from your keyboard you will find out here the run window now simply type here percentage local add it up percentage and hit enter now find out here fortnite game folder go for saved config windows client and here you will find out your game use settings file you can guys also replace this file with the downloaded file which I show you in the first step. So guys this is the manual one so guys we are going to talk about it. So in the very first step you need to go for your game view settings and open up properties. Make sure guys uncheck the box that is the read only therefore we can make the changes inside this file. Now hit apply, click ok. Now double tap and open up the game view settings on your PC. Now here guys in the very first step you need to change here this motion blur settings. And guys set it onto the false by default it is on the true but you need to set it onto the false for having the more performance next here we got this b show grass so guys you need to go for this option and set it onto the false make sure you use the same capitalization therefore it can properly apply on your pc now next here we got show fps i have already set it onto the false next here we got this b use gpu crash to debugging i have already set it onto the false Next here we got B stop rendering in the background, make sure to all set it on the false. Therefore we can render everything in the front of our screen, not in any the background. Therefore we can save our resources. Next here we got B latency tweak 1, I have set it on the false. You also need to set it on the false. Next here we got latency tweak 2, set it on to the 1. After that, now scroll down and guys find out some other settings that is very important for you. And that is this energy saving enable. Guys, go for it and make sure guys turn off the energy saving on your uh, Fortnite game settings. Simply set it onto the false. Now copy this value, go for the second one and also paste it here and set it onto the false. Next here we go to this energy saving level focus, lose set it onto the one because this is not effect because we have already set it onto the false. Now scroll down and now you need to find out here some other settings that is very important. And guys here we find out over the settings that is the allow low power mode so therefore make sure guys set it on the false so therefore we can get the maximum performance out of our pc now next scroll down and find out this resolution quality and find out here this resolution size x and resolution size y and guys by changing the settings you can guys get a huge fps increase in your performance if you would use this resolution so guys choose it wisely according to your pc according to your monitor and according to your gpu personally i am playing with the native one that is the 920 by 1080p but guys if you have a low-end pc so you can use my best game your settings and there you will find that all the best resolution according to your pc specs simply guys paste here that file it will do everything for you in just one single click but guys, for the high-end PC, mid-end PC, and low-end PC, choose here the resolution according to your PC specs and simply replace here these values. I am going with the ready one because this will work best for my PC. So guys, once you have applied all the settings, next here you will find out scalability group. You need to go for this resolution quality and set it on to the 85 because 85 works best for me and also most of the pro players also set it on to the 85%. Next here we go to this view distance quality, make sure guys set it on to the zero. Next, anti aliasing quality, set it onto the zero. Shadow quality, set it onto the zero. Global illumination quality, set it onto the zero. Reflection quality, set it onto the zero. Post processing quality, set it onto the zero. Texture filtering quality, set it onto the zero. The next heavy got effect quality, set it also onto the zero. The next heavy got foolish quality, set it onto the zero. 
The next here we got shading quality, make sure to also set it on to the zero and at the end here we find out landscape quality, also make sure to set it on to the zero. These settings like shading one, foolish one and the landscape quality, this is not available in your Fortnite in game so therefore you need to disable it from the game view settings. Once you are done, now you need to go for the file option, hit save and save all the settings inside your game view settings. Now simply close out of it, now simply launch your Fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of your PC. I hope so you love it, please make sure to let me know your opinion about this video in the comment below and I will see you in the next video.